Hi, my name is Roger Lawson and I'm a certified strength and conditioning coach here at All Access Fitness Academy. And today I want to show you a few different core exercise variations that you can throw into your exercise training program to give yourself a little bit of variety uh, as opposed to what you're used to doing. So let's get started. So this first exercise I want to show you is called the stability ball rollout. And what this trains is, you know, more of our anterior core, which is right in the, the front. And the role of that is to prevent us from extending. So if you see, you know, if you see people with this uh, kind of, you know, chest out, hips forward kind of posture, that's actually not what you want to, you know, A, have in your everyday life and B, you don't want to mimic that in your actual core training. So what this exercise does is prevents you from going into a hyperextension. It keeps you nice and flat. So for the first thing you want to do to set up this up, is to put your hands on the ball and I would turn your knees out to about 45 degrees and bring your feet together and then after that you're going to squeeze your glutes to lock your hips into place and then the first step after that is you're going to push your hips forward and let your arms go forward as well until your head comes down then you want to use nothing but your core to come on back a common mistake that people do is that they lead with their arms and not their hips. So something along those lines would look more like this. And then their hips kind of drop down. Okay, so the next variation I want to show you is uh, a bit of a twist on the regular plank, which many of you might be familiar with. And this is called a plank with, with shoulder touch. So this is also preventing you from going into extension, but it's also focusing on your obliques a bit, because now you're resisting the rotation that, that gravity is going to be, you know, be pressing down on you as you move your arms. So, for this you're going to get to the top of a push-up position. You're going to squeeze your glutes to lock your hips into place. Then you're going to take one hand off the ground, touch your shoulder, pause for a second, come back down, switch, just like that. What you don't want to do is raise your hand and have your hips twist or sink. All right, so this last variation is called a, a standing dumbbell suitcase hold. And it's pretty much similar how you would hold a, a suitcase or a bag, but the difference is now you're using a, a heavier weight, so you're going to be resisting the dumbbell pulling you down. So you see people when they do dumbbell side bends, they're actually not really training their core for stabilization. So what you want to do is take a, a heavy dumbbell, stand right up just like this, and just let the weight hang straight down. Don't bend to the side, just stand as straight up as you can and you want to hold this ideally for about 30 to 45 seconds each arm. All right, so that was just a small sample of the core exercise that we use in our programs here at All Access. So if you're looking to kind of take your core training to the next level, you can give us a call at 508-845-3974 or you can just stop on in and say hi to me and we can talk more about it.